Good morning, Yahoo! Hey, good morning, y'all. Old Hillbilly Joel here. Right now, I'm about to get busy. I got uh, my delivery of cement blocks, and we're gonna go on to the next part of our project. The next part of our project is right here. Is gonna be one bed, and right here is gonna be another bed. So we're gonna have two beds. Oh, and then, I don't know, we'll figure it out as we go along. I got the plan in my head, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna make two beds, and I got all my little cement blocks over there, and we're fixing to get busy this morning. And this morning, we're gonna build two beds. Okay, y'all, I'll give you some updates as I progress. Okay. Well now y'all, this is what we're doing next. We took cement and we're mixing up the cement. And how you mix up cement to make a strong mixture would be to mix 50% sand and 50% water. Right now, we add water and 50% cement, 50% sand. And then you add water. And what we're doing is letting the water soak in and everything like that. And what it does is it soaks up into the cement and it soaks up into the sand. And then we mix it. And I got a tub here in order to mix the cement to the amount that I want to keep going and mixing, mixing as I put down the cement blocks. And uh, that's what I'm doing. I'm mixing it up right now and I'm letting it soak in. And that's what you do. You do 50% sand, 50% cement. And then you just keep adding water until you get the right mixture that you want, the thickness that you want. You don't want to overwater it because then it becomes soupy and it doesn't hold anything at all. Okay, here we go. We're going to keep going. Okay, guess what? Here we go. Now I'm going to give you a little bit more information here. Now when you mix up your cement with your 50% sand and 50% cement, and you can mix it up inside your container. If you're doing a small project, you mix it up in a little container, okay? But if you're doing a big project, this would be too entirely too slow. But what you want to have your cement look like is you want your cement to look like a cake mix, okay? When you're mixing, you want your spoon, when you're mixing, to go right straight through. Easy mixing, okay? easy mixing like you're doing a cake so when you do a cake you mix it up like a cake right now when you finish to the consistency you want and you want to test it you stick it in like that and if your if your spoon stands straight up or your mixing thingy stands straight up like that that means it's perfect mixture and then you can go ahead and lay down your bricks with this mixture. That's what we'll be doing next. Okay, here we go. Okay, here I am again. Well, the second bed frame is in there, made of cement blocks. As you can see, I don't know how well you can see it, but the cement blocks are too high, up in the, two, two, stack two up in the air. Okay. I don't know how well you can see it, but here and there are the two beds. I don't know how well. It might be a little dark for you to see it, but maybe I can get you a, a different direction here. Oh, there you go, a little better. Anyway, that's the wall. And then on top will be, that's that'll be the inside will be the storage. I don't know if you can see it very well, but it's a little better than, uh, there you go, maybe I, you can see it like that. Uh, and then you got the second one right here, and the second one looks about the same, 
adds uh, this one over there. And maybe I can shoot it this way. Now uh, then you just get a dark area. Oh well, you just get a dark area. But anyway, you get the idea. The idea of what the bed storage area is going to look like just by that little area right there. So I just had to show you a quick update on the progress of what's going on here. I got to finish off the siding of the bricks to make it smooth. Okay. But we're going to get there slowly but surely. There's one. And then you. I don't know if you can see it very well. You can't see it very well, but here's the second one. Right there's the second one. The second one looks like that one over there too, so they're about identical. And then the next one is gonna be a third bed. And I'm gonna do that one tomorrow, starting tomorrow. I'm gonna measure this one right in here. And you can see some of the cement blocks right there, but they're gonna be put over here for a third bed. So this is just a quick update for you. I wish I had more light for you to see it, but later on, uh, you're gonna see the finished product. Right now, I just had to get something out there so you can see. And then right over here, next to this little area right there will be a dining room table with four chairs. Huh? Well, this was your quick update. The third bed will be right here. And one bed here. As you can see the frame, but it's really dark. And then you got the outer bed frame right there. So you can see what that one, that one was gonna look like this one, so don't worry. You'll see the finished product later, but there you go. I gave you an update on the progress of the cabin. This is old Hillbilly Joe's cabin giving you an update on what's going on. The windows are already beautiful. I still got to do the plumbing over here. I got to do the bathroom over here. I got to finish the sides and the walls and shelving and whatever other little ideas I got going on. I got to finish a little bit more on the uh, kitchen area right over there. But other than that... This is what the little frame is looking like. I gotta finish the cement blocks. You're gonna have storage right there. You're gonna have a bed right there. An extension right over here on the side so you can flip it up and make a wider bed. Okay, y'all. This is old Hillbilly Joe. Till next time.